Hi guys, um, it's, we've been having the most beautiful weather. It's been so hot that we're already having a burn ban, and it's the 10th of April. Um, when I look at Facebook and the memories, we've had snow April 13th, um, and that was years ago, but I know we've had snow like um, around this time, like in 2017 and whenever else. And uh, I'm feeling it. Like, I feel great because of the sun. I love the sun. Um, to me, it means something different to other people, I think. Um, like, my father died of skin cancer. Like, um, he, we, we think it's because he had really, um, you know, he was like sort of a redhead. Like, um, not completely, but you know, that skin is very, um, you know, it's easy to burn and that sort of thing. And he went to Egypt. He was an engineer, so he was building things down there. Um, for like a year he lived there. And uh, and then sun, um, sun cancer takes about 20 years to develop, uh, from what I've heard. I've already had, um, because of genetics, I already had about seven, at least seven moles removed, um, not cosmetic, the, um, doctor, the dermatologist said that it looked like skin cancer, or I know at least one, um, the biopsy said it was pre-cancer. Um, I've also had a friend who I met one time, I know it's not a lot, like, she was kind of an acquaintance, but we knew each other on Twitter, and she died of skin cancer, and she got it twice, and she had a family, and her son was in med school, and her daughter was 17, and, you know, I still have her blogs and stuff like that, um, I don't know what it goes under, but her name was Laurel Anderson, and, uh, you know, she was great, and, uh, always seemed happy, but, uh, you know, my neighbor, he, he would also understand about the sun, because he always wears, like, long shirts and long pants year-round and a hat, because he got a really bad burn this one time. For me, I just wear sunblock. I'm, like, happy with that. It feels, my, my vitamin D is wonderful. I just feel happy, happy, happy. But I've had a couple of friends say, oh, I'm getting a tan. I want to work on my tan. And I'm thinking, okay. <laughs> and then they're like, why don't you want the same? And I have to go and explain what I just explained to you guys. And, uh, I don't know, my stepdad, he died of pancreatic cancer in September. And my dad, um, and his cancer, like, the both cancers were different. And I don't know if, um, it's different when you die of different specific cancers, but my dad's skin cancer was terrible, like, um, I don't know, he just got so skinny, he couldn't even talk at the end, like, his vocal cords were, like, strange, like, talked like a bird, and, uh, it was crazy, but, you know, like, I mean, I don't know, I don't, I don't think it's cool, but, like, at the same time, if you're not genetically prone, then do what you want, and also, my, um, lithium that I take is, um, it causes burning, sometimes, like it's hypophotosensitive or whatever, and there's another med that I take that is also photosensitive, so I gotta be careful, but it doesn't mean that I can't enjoy the sun, like I said, I love the sun, and you know what, we're gonna go down, so for like people that deal with Celsius, because I haven't done this conversion, um, like about 13 Celsius pretty soon for like a week, um, and raining on and off, so... <laughs> not going to be last forever, but I find it's really funny the way that our winter with the snow jumps into summer really quick and then, you know, twirls around and tries to figure itself out. But anyway, today is a great day.